Hey guys, Ito here, and welcome back to another FIFA 17 tutorial. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to score a Scorpion Kick on FIFA 17. Now, the Scorpion Kick is one of the hardest and best looking tricks or skills to pull off on all of FIFA, and this is what it looks like. <laughs> You're going to want the player who's actually going to cross the ball into your player to do the scorpion kick to be ahead of the player who's in the middle to do that scorpion kick. So as you can see here, Thiago is in front of uh, Lewandowski, which means that he is going to be in the position to actually get the ball behind him to go into that scorpion kick animation. Now to do the scorpion kick, you need to hold LT and press the shoot button. You don't want to hold it for too long or it will go over the bar, which is not what you want to do. You want to get it on target and yeah, you just want to tap the, uh, the shoot button and hold the left trigger. If you put all of those together and get everything perfect because to score a scorpion kick everything has to be perfect, the cross has to be perfect, the player has to be in the perfect position and you've got to have the right player. If you manage to do that you should get a perfect result and be able to score some great goals uh, like the one you can see on screen right here. Now you can score some of the best goals imaginable really on FIFA with the scorpion kick. You can be quite creative with them, you can maybe play a corner to the top of the box you guys should be able to see on screen right here something that happened to me back on FIFA 16. Very nearly scored a scorpion kick volley from the edge of the penalty area, which was pretty insane. Uh, I've scored two previous goals on FIFA 16 with a scorpion kick, but since FIFA 13, I've only ever scored two scorpion kicks. It's such a hard skill to actually do. Now, you won't always do a scorpion kick. You may uh, end up doing a bicycle kick, maybe a flying back heel. A flying back heel is actually even rarer. Uh, than a scorpion kick. I've never even seen the animation for a flying back heel actually happen to me in a game. Uh, there are a couple of other kind of flying in air uh, skill shots people can do, which looks pretty cool, uh, but uh, most of the time you're probably going to go in for a header and end up scoring a header instead. Uh, but if you get everything perfect, you will end up scoring a scorpion kick. They look absolutely insane, and you can do them from pretty much anywhere. I mean, if you're just kind of getting used to it, trying to learn the controls, definitely try in the penalty area, maybe on an easy difficulty offline, so you can just get used to that cross, get used to the controls you want to, uh, to press to actually do this. But you can go into the scorpion kick animation from like 50 yards out. You just need to get it on target. You can try in the practice arena, and you can score some amazing goals like that. Um, but yeah, I have seen people score like 30 or 40 yard scorpion kicks. I'll try and show a couple of these uh, on screen. As I am talking right here, there are some very, very good ones on YouTube. But uh, yeah, definitely try this out, guys. Even when you just normally cross the ball into the middle for a cross, hold LC at the same time when you press that shoot button. And you never know, you could end up pulling off an awesome scorpion kick goal or something like that. And uh, if you do, definitely tweet me a picture or a video of that goal because they look so cool. Definitely is a great thing on FIFA, uh, which you very rarely see actually pull off but when you do manage to pull it off it looks absolutely insane hopefully this video should help you guys out it's not something you're going to be scoring every match i mean if you score like one or two in one fifa you're, you're pretty lucky but hopefully this video should help you out maybe help you score one or two more scorpion kicks and if you didn't know scorpion kicks even existed because i mean so few people actually score them many of you probably would have never even seen one of these be scored either by you or against you but uh, if you didn't know about it, here you go. This video should hopefully help you out. Maybe you'll be able to score one or two in the future. Also, guys, the web app is coming out in literally one or two days. So I can't wait to get those trader videos out for you guys. You guys know trading is the main content I do on my channel. FIFA 17 trading is going to be awesome. I've got some huge trading guides uh, for FIFA 17. They're going to be coming out in the next week or so. Can't wait to do those. Got the web app coming out soon. Got 12,000 FIFA points ready to spam some packs. Hoping for like an inform Messi who could potentially get an inform. We got like two goals and an assist on the weekend. Uh, some other awesome players could potentially be in that team of the week. So can't wait for that. I'm also going to be doing a ton of squad builders. My main content on FIFA 17 for those of you uh, who don't really know. I have been talking about some of this stuff on Twitter. But the main things I'm going to be doing are trading and squad builders. Is my two main content kind of videos. I'm also going to be doing a monthly big pack opening. And I'm going to also be doing player reviews at the beginning of FIFA 17. Uh, for lots of the big players as well as these kind of tutorial videos occasionally as well I'm trying to do a load of those at the moment because obviously we've got the demo and we haven't got too much more other than these type of videos so if you guys do enjoy these type of videos if there are any other type of tutorials you do want to see maybe a, a, another skill move tutorial some of the new skill moves on the game anything like that comment down below I'll be sure to Maybe a new kind of skill move tutorial for some of the new skill moves on FIFA 17. Maybe a long shot tutorial. Anything like that. Comment that down below. I'll be sure to do that in the next couple of days. But anyway, I really hope you guys have enjoyed. I'm actually going to be going to the Man City against Swansea game 
in the uh, League Cup. I think it's called like the EFL Cup now. It has changed its name, but I'm going to be going to see that uh, on Wednesday, I believe, which I think may be the day the web app comes out. So, uh, yeah, not really too sure how that's going to go down, but going to be going there, going to be vlogging that, going to be an away game, which should be pretty interesting. Hope you guys do enjoy that. Hope you enjoyed this video right here, and I'll see you in my next video. Take care.